How effective are COVID-19 vaccines in cancer patients? The answer remains unclear, but researchers at the Ottawa Hospital Research Institute are now working to find out. We don't have good data on the efficacy of the COVID-19 vaccines um, in, uh, in the cancer population. And as you know, there are 2.1 million Canadians that suffer from uh, ca uh, cancer. And, uh, and so it is a significant public health issue. Dr. Glenwood Goss is lead researcher in a government-funded study looking at COVID-19 vaccine efficacy in different types of cancer. The study just launched under a month ago and is currently recruiting participants. Goss says up until now, the only data available on this has been from two small studies, one in the UK and another in the US and Switzerland. We know that they, after the first dose, the immune response is lower than in the normal population. Uh, we, that's what came out of these studies. After the second dose, it really depends on which cancer population you're looking at. He says based on those studies, those with blood cancers did not respond as well to the second dose, while those with other types of cancer but who were not undergoing chemotherapy generally mounted a similar response to the general population. Still, he says those studies had their flaws. The research currently being conducted is larger in scale and is intended to drive public policy, including whether booster shots will be needed. I think in a vulnerable population like the cancer population, it is likely that booster shots will be necessary uh, down the line, but we don't have data to support that at this time. In the U.S., federal regulators have already given the green light to allow booster shots for some vulnerable populations. But here in Canada, the nation's top doctor only saying discussions are ongoing. For now, our top priority remains ensuring as many people in Canada who are eligible are vaccinated. Should we not be at Canada already be looking at a program to get extra shots to? Uh, I would order? not. I would not recommend that at this time. We don't know. City News did reach out to Health Canada. They tell us that the country's expert panel on vaccines is essentially on the same page, saying there's no data yet to support a third dose. Now, preliminary results from the Ottawa Hospital study likely won't be available until sometime next year. For City News, I'm Erica Natividad.